for the event. Thank you. Yeah. That one is stress bay real, right? Um yeah. Okay. Okay. You wanna just yeah. Yes. Did you just compete? Yeah, 6'8". How'd it go? He loved it. Good. Um, a little bit more drama. Mm. So. Yeah. Do you mind checking my tuning one last time? He's got a... Oh, then go, go. Do you, do you, have, a, do you have some time? Because he's got to play next. He's in his drones um, are out here. I'm next over at 2. Okay. But you yeah. don't worry about it. I think they're fairly in tune. Do you, do you want to listen to him real quick? Yeah. Just listen. in front of you and then you're going to be next. So. Okay. I'll just keep breathing through the... What? I'll just keep breathing the... Yep. yep. The... Are your fingers slippery enough now? They're a little bit more slippery. Um, not as much as I want, but... Do you want to put some more on your face here? Yeah. Yeah, you'll have to bring some... Uh... Is that better? Yeah. So yeah, yeah, you'll have to bring like cornstarch or something like that. Well, we have some lotion, so. Is it because it's humid? Is that what makes the yep. fingers sticky? Yep, exactly. Yeah, and the more sticky your fingers are, the more you'll miss the brace notes. Yep, yep. So. I'm sure I try to avoid it. That's grade three, right? Jeez. What's his name? Michael. Okay. Does he want to go nap for him? Okay. Those are good sounding pipes though.
Michael, hi. How you doing? Great. I'm doing. Um, for my stress day, I'm doing Lady Loudon, and for my real, I'm doing Sandy uh, Camp. Whenever you're ready. Some things get out of out of hand, you know, with all your. Your e doublings are just some of them are getting a little clippy, and then in the third part when you're uh, right, it's just some you're a little you're trying to make them a little too tight, so you're just losing some swing at, at those spots. So right? when you say clippy, you're kind of right forcing them instead of. Right? And you're a little bit tight, you know, they're, they're little, too close together fast. in there a little bit. A little fast, right? Yeah. To where you've got good enough fingers to do them really clear, you know, and it might be nerves of competition, but I think you could just be a little, little clearer on those, right? Your tempos are great, but at those spots, there's, a, there's just a little push and you lose a little swing because they're kind of a little too tight. Mm -hmm. you know, that's what I mean by clipping. Okay. 
and 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 your fingers are good enough you just just take a little time open those movements up a little bit when you're practicing on a channel or something right get where you're comfortable you can always make them a little tighter right everybody can make them a little tighter but if, if you get to where you're get the clarity in there right that's gonna make a big difference okay all right brilliant instrument yeah thanks nice they're, instrument. they're nail pipes by the way very nice good job yeah thanks thank you thank you same thing again, I think. Yeah, just relax. You're just <laughs> trying to be too tight. Does that make sense? Yeah. yeah. I think it's, it's probably because I'm afraid they'll say your grace notes are too slow or something. Don't. You're just you're doing, you're doing too fast. Just relax. <laughs> I don't think I've ever, I've rarely heard comments about grace notes too fast. I've mostly heard comments about grace notes. Other pipers, they're very to too slow to speed them up. So I, because I heard that, I thought, oh, I gotta speed my brakes notes up. And I didn't realize they're too fast now, you know. Yeah. So, you just gotta, they want clearer notes. That's what, when they're too fast and they don't, they're not clear. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you just gotta relax them. Just relax them a little bit, okay? Yeah, it could be because I, cause it's my last competition, I don't know. Well, no, but you need to learn that first next time, right? Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, you're fine. You just sit down. Oops. Sounds like everybody's in the tent. Well, as much as you can be, yeah. What? Are they in our tent? Well, everybody's sharing, so that's what, that's what you do. Here, hold your tape player for a second. I want to hold the sheet. How old did that other Tom look? What? How old do you think that other Tom was? Probably my age, or a little bit older. What about the Tom that for my 6'8"? So, that was stress me real, right? Yeah. I don't know what I don't know what Tom it was. You played your six eight, right? Stress me real, right? Yep. So you have you have two four and then your jig right? Yeah. So the two four starts at ten forty five. Is that Tammy behind me? Yeah. Yeah, she's playing the make of pipes that I'm not familiar with. I, I don't remember that. It began with a P. We'll have to. We'll have to, we'll have to ask her. I don't remember the name of it. it began with a P. Your wife's just moving in your other seat over here to your left. Let me sit in that one. Because that one's for me. <laughs> it's, 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 it holds me better. I broke the other one. Like oh, that. yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe how sticky it is today. I know. I think that's what's affecting my playing. It could be. Yeah. And I guess that's what the thought was. I can be almost anywhere. Well, and that's just... Uh, Yeah. Okay. 
How much time do I have before my next well, event? They haven't started. It starts at 10:45, which is seven minutes, and um, you are one, two, three, or four. Okay. Okay. Jake, Jake starts, and then you'll follow Patrick. Jake, Jim, Marie, Patrick, and Marie. Uh, this will be two four, right? Uh, yep. Okay. Two four heads. You're gonna have the same judge you just had. What? You're gonna have this for two four the same judge you just had, okay? Oh, okay. So now, does it, what he said does that go forward with your two four as well? I think, so, yeah. So can you do what he said? Yeah. So, okay, just try that and see what happens. Mm -hmm. okay. Just see how, how well you can correct it. I'll go get the one two here. <laughs> what kind of practice channel is that? That's perfectly in tune. How about you? Kind of a sticky day. Yeah, that's why we got some got some lotion because he said he says it's so sticky you can't. Yeah, I usually drink baby powder. Not got it. Yeah, this is next. I'm gonna grab some next year cornstarch and just. Didn't you say baby powder was bad for you? Well, you should. Yeah. On the on the tender bits, yes. Yeah. Skin yeah, and then uh, you shouldn't, in, if you accidentally inhaled it too, it just kind of... I can't imagine that's good no matter what. <laughs> yeah, talc is not up. How's this pass then? Too much. Alright, so we're starting at 2-4, looks like Jake's up. Yeah, we're following you, so... Jake has the best sounding pipes on the whole planet. So it's just, uh... They're Henderson. And you can you can immediately tell they're in this like yeah. if you just strike up. You're a fan, huh? I yeah. wish these were bored to Henderson specs, but they're not. I'm not really a big fan of the nail sound anymore. Or you wanna try some of this on your fingers and see? Yeah. Because as as pipers yeah. keep saying, you know, the more refined your ears become, the more. You're, done. You're all done? Did yep. you do well? I feel like I did. Is this hands dry? No, sticky. sticky. One thing that may sound contrary is a uh, lotion is actually good for getting. That's what I have on my hand. Okay. I, I went and grabbed some lotion and put it on my hand, and that's mm. what he's. Yeah. It's it get get it's what. Lotion, lotion is, is good. kind of a, yeah because slippery. I once, mm -hmm. I once got a gorilla glue stuck on my fingers, and lotion helped get most of it off. There's still a little bit of stickiness, but if you know gorilla glue. Yeah. I'm glad my fingers aren't stuck together. Gorilla glue. What's that? It's like really, really st strong glue. Is that is that a little bit better with this? A little bit more on my. Thank you. I had some on my face this morning. I said wipe my face. So. Oh. That's my least favorite six eight in the whole world. What do you play next? Two four. Two four. Yep. Okay. How'd you, how'd you end up doing? Pretty well, you think? I'm happy with how I played. Good. So. That's all that matters. Yep. So. so. Um, yeah. I'll put this on my head for now. Here, do you want to drink some more? 
Are you guys going to stay for the whole games? Mm, we'll probably leave after we get the results because... Mm, probably not because it's just a long drive. Yeah. What if you get Piper of the Day? Oh, Piper of uh, Grade 3. Yeah. No? No. Yeah. Huh. They won't. It won't happen. Did you have to provide the music for your um, Pete Brock? Uh, no. He said, uh, do you have the music? I, I have it in my case, but I know it's in that book he has. He's like, okay, good. Because um, they're making everybody, I, right in the uh, application it says, to make sure that you have your... Yeah, I mean, I had it. It's, it's like, I have it in my pipe case if you want me to go get it. He's like, no, you're already here. I might yeah. as well just get it from the book. Did Michael not bring his? He did. Okay, good. We got an Elma. He said, Michael goes, Well, I don't read music. He goes, I still need the music. Yeah, Michael, I said I was going to play you my uh, corn pipe and jig if you want to listen to it. Yeah. I'll do it on the practice channel. Oh, is that the viola that I hear? Yep. Are you done? Yep. First part. Fourth part. What's that one called? I haven't named it yet. I wrote it myself though. Oh. Cool. I mean, it's my major, so I sort of have to. It's... what? What do you mean? I'm a composition major at MSU, so... I, I'm required to write music, and so I, I feel like it'd be dishonoring the bagpipes if I didn't write something for them. But, yeah, eventually I'll make a book of my compositions. It sounds decent enough. Thank you. It's also the for, first hornpipe I've written, so it's probably uh, very basic and like <laughs> almost every other hornpipe. <laughs> because that's how I uh, essentially... Uh, wrote it. Wrote it to mimic the other ones. Because that's how what composers do. Well when they're starting off mm -hmm. writing stuff. They mimic people before them until they understand it enough to do it themselves. Yep. Michael's twin writes music. And she um, she bases it off of sounds in nature or and one of the last ones she wrote was, you know, the, the chimes that you have on an airline yeah. to buckle your seatbelt, so she wrote it on the theme of that. Oh, nice. What? The person competing is not in two. I know, I hear that too. What? Do you need help? Do you want me to help you? I'm a really good yeah. tuner. He's good. Sure, if one of you want to tune, that would be good, because I don't know where my other tuners are. Do you want to help me, Michael? Yeah, um, I'm, I, have, I have a, one of the best ears. Yeah. Oh, we can, we he can has earplugs. I have earplugs. <laughs> <laughs> Pedigree. Okay,
What, you. what tune was that? It's Michael McGinnis. What was it? Michael McGinnis. Oh, who wrote it? Do you know? Yeah. I like that one. Yeah. Michael, quick question. Yep. Which, I have your phone number 616-818-5535. 5355. Okay. <laughs> okay, there we go. Are you on Facebook? No. No. Okay, well, yeah, I'll send you a message to see what competitions you're doing, probably like January, February. Oh, okay. I'll probably I can do the up. Alma one. There's yeah, I, I'm video. planning on doing it if I can, yeah. but I'm not sure. I don't, when was that last year, Michael? Remember what month? February 20th. February. Mm -hmm. February. Mm. What video? Oh, you might be beaten. Um, I was asking because there's a, and maybe you heard it too, there's a, a lady who plays, no, a lady plays bagpipes to jazz music. Oh, okay. Well, those aren't Highland bagpipes. I know they're not. What pipes are they? They got the one drone, so it's a, it didn't look like a small pipe. I thought they were Portland pipes, maybe. maybe. Who is that? What was her I, name? I don't know. No, no, wait, no, I remember uh, somebody commented on that. They were the Norwegian traditional bagpipes. Oh, okay. Or were they the Spanish Gaita? No, it was Norwegian because uh, the person who commented on it said, uh, yeah, these are the Norwegian pies and she's also from Norway, so. Oh, okay.